Our on breaking news out of Milford. The family of murdered high school student Marin Sanchez now suing the city and the Board of Education. They say she told school counselors the teen who killed her was mentally disturbed before he stabbed her in a school stairwell. Marin Sanchez was killed the morning of the junior prom. Hi everybody, glad you're here tonight. I'm Darren Kramer. And I'm Ann Craig. Marin Sanchez was brutally attacked by her classmate Chris Plaskin right there in the hallway because she rejected his invitation to prom. That shocking murder happened in 2014 and now her family says that Marin told a school counselor she was worried that Plaskin would hurt himself or someone else. And after that warning, the lawsuit claims proper school procedure was not followed. News H Josh Scheinblum has been going through that lawsuit. He joins us live from Milford with those details tonight. Josh. Good evening, and we're here outside of Jonathan Law High School. Back in 2014, the violence that transpired here sent shockwaves throughout the community, and now News 8 has learned that the family of Marin Sanchez has filed a lawsuit over what had transpired. Now, we've been going through those documents, and what we do know is that the lawsuit was filed by Marin's mother and alleges that her daughter had reached out to the guidance department expressing concerns that her would-be killer, Christopher Plaskin, was emotional disturbed, even alleging that he would bring a knife to school. Now, Plaskin, along with members of his family, the city of Milford, and the Board of Education are all listed as defendants in the lawsuit. Now, through the family's attorney, the mother of the victim released the following statement about the developments. She says in it, quote, we feel there was an opportunity here for the school system and the Plaskins' parents to intervene to prevent Marin's death from happening. We're bringing this lawsuit to make sure that reports like the one Marin made are properly handled and that parents and school personnel will respond to protect minor children from terrible injury and death, end quote. Now, officials with the school district are also speaking out about the lawsuit. We also received the following statement from Milford Superintendent of Schools. It reads in part, quote, Quote, the Milford Public Schools has been made aware of civil litigation filed on behalf of Marin Sanchez. With respect to the legal process, we will refrain on commenting on this case and allow the judicial system to determine the outcome. Now, Plaskin, who is now 18 years of age, pleaded no contest to murder earlier this month. For now, we're live in Milford, Josh Scheinblum, News 8. All right, Josh, thank you. It was just last week that 18 year old Christopher Plaskin accepted a plea deal. Now he's going to spend up to 25 years behind bars. A formal sentencing is now set for June. Plaskin could be eligible for parole after just 13 years in jail.